Hello, welcome to next slide tutorial. In this segment, we can see how to install iRedmail mail server in Linux. So, iRedmail is one of the best open source mail server, and with this iRedmail mail server, you can deploy a full future mail server in few minutes. And we can see a glance about its features. Uh, it's available on most of the Linux distributions such as Red Hat, CentOS, Ubuntu, Linux Mint, OpenSUSE, etc and it supports both apache and nginx web server and it consists of docker postsql and for webmail it, it will use the round cube setup and it have an additional feature uh, such as antivirus for that we are using spam assassin and clam av so now we can go for the installation process and for this setup we must have a static ip address and the fully qualified domain name with the mx record points to your mail server and it can accessible via the minimal installation and also the desktop installation oh yes so now we can check for the static ip address and i have set my ip address ip address is 192.168.5.87 and my fully qualified domain name you can check it using hostname command and with hyphen f option to means that fully qualified domain name so my fully qualified domain name is mail.therefomic.com and now we can go for iredmail installation so we can install the iredmail through wget command so by running this command you can see the latest version of 9.4 is uh, downloaded and installed in the system and in case if you got some error while using wget command we can directly download through the official website that is www.iredmail.org and we can download directly over there so there you can see that the tar package with let tar package of iredmail latest version is downloaded and now we have to extract that package xvjf i redmail so now the package is extracted now go inside that package in this directory you can see i script so while running the script it will start installing the redmail server so at first we can make the script to executable mode dch mode plus x iredmail.sh so now you can see that the script is now in executable mode so before that we can install some additional packages for that go to pkgs directory and there you can see that the get underscore all dot sh script so change the mode and now we have to run the script So once the script is started, it will start comparing the available packages and the installed packages. So the available packages, these four packages with the latest version is compared to the repository and it's all in the latest version. So it will skip out. And next, we can go for installation. And now we have to run the installation script. iredmail.sh This is the welcome screen that appears after the installation script is started. Just give S and here it displays the default mail storage path and we don't need to change the path and just give next and it will ask for the preferred web server. So here I'm selecting the Apache web server and give next and here it will ask for the mail accounts to store mail accounts what the database to be used. So here I'm selecting the MySQL and click next and here we have to mention the mail domain name so before I have given the fully qualified domain name as mail.lfomit.com so now uh, here I am giving as linuxhelp.com and give next and it will ask for the password password I am giving and give next and here we can check uh, here we can add some additional packages and these are the default packages and I don't need to mention any other packages so just give next 
and it will ask for the final confirmation test queue yes it will start installing the packages what we mentioned over before so once the packages are installed it will start configuring the irid mail so at last i read uh, mail server installation is complete and if you want to log in through round cube web mail this is the link and if you want to log in through web admin panel and this is the link and this is the login details such as username and the password and if you want to know some more tips we can go in redmail and iredmail folder and in that we are having a text file called iredmail.tips we can read some uh, additional tips in this file and once the whole setup is done we have to reboot the system to enable all the mail services so now rebooting the system and after the first reboot of our system we can just go through the redmail tips file so we iredmail dot tips so this is the tips file and this file contains our admin login details and the username password smtp which is login and the connection security of ssl and the location of the ssl certificate keys and the mail storage location apache configuration file location and this file also contains our mysql login details such as username and the encrypted password and also the location of postfix and docker configuration files and at last wrong cube with mail configuration file location and the login details is also shown on this tips file and now we can log in through the browser so i can call my ip 5.87/irate admin so it will not prompt us to enter since this is ssl certified we need to provide https in front so now the login page appears so we can log in using the username postmaster at linuxhelp.com and the password is 12345678 and this is the home page of irid admin panel so to add a user just click add on the user and the user name i am giving is test at linuxhelp.com and the password 12345678 and the display name is test hyphen mail just click add so now the user is created uh, so if you want to add some domain you can click domain and just give the domain name here i'm giving linuxhelp1.com so organization just give xyz and add so now new domain is also created to display the created domains and accounts just go to domains and accounts and there you can see the created domains nextgelp.com and nextgelp1.com and at last you can see the number of users just click the number and you can see the users which is created in this nextgelp.com domain so postmaster is the default user and the test mail that is test at nextgelp.com is the user which is created by me before so this i admin admin panel is only for the admin purpose as we seen earlier the mail interface is provided by phone cube web mail setup so to log in just call your ip with mail at last so https and my ip 5.87 and slash mail so now the round cube login page is displayed so the username which we created over there is test at linuxhelp.com and the password 678 and then login so now this is the home page of our round cube web mail and before that we can log in to our admin account because once the setup is done in red main admin panel uh, the login credentials and some important details will be sent to that admin so postmaster at linuxhelp.com and the password 
so this is the admin and there you can see the in see in the inbox two initial mails and this mail gives the useful resources about the red mail and this gives the details of this red mail that is the username account username and the password and the and some other login details so to create a mail just click compose and from the postmaster.com and to the destination at linux help.com and the subject you can mention as test and the content to test mail that's it if you want to attach some files you can run over here and just click send your message will be sent successfully thus the red mail setup is done completely and to check the services that are running you can check over here using the net start command with hyphen t l p n so you can see that the services that are running for the iRed mail server that is docker master and http shd and the port reserve and to check for the log tail f space where log and mail log so you can see that the log of the iRed mail and hope this video will be very useful in installing iRed mail mail server Thanks for watching.